This is how to enjoy a Kiwi SDR. And we're going to take a little tour and take a look and see how a Kiwi SDR works and how to set it up. So here we go. We first go to a browser and we dial in Kiwi SDR map and hit enter. And it's the top entry, Kiwi SDR map. You click on that and you'll see a listing of individual receivers, but you'll also see the button that says Kiwi SDR map. So you press that as well. And you'll see a map of the world. Okay, so where we're going today is the northern part of Ireland. So double click and double click and double click to zoom in all the way to the northern tip of Ireland to a place called Mallon Head, which used to be a telegrapher's station. And you click on the icon and then you click on the legend. And here we go to Finbar's Kiwi SDR. All right. And right now, he's on 20 meters, but we're going to get down to 40 meters. Let's see if it's listed here. 41 meters. And we're going to go to AM. And let's try down the band a bit. Seven, one, two, zero, enter. So, what are we doing here? And let's start hearing hand communications. And if we're going to be listening to voice, let's switch to lower sideband. And press plus 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 to make the display a little bit wider. And then we'll adjust the frequency. Let's find out where they are. It actually sounds pretty good. So let's try 7140. I can see something's going on there. 7140. Echo Alpha 5, November. Whiskey returning. Yeah, no problem at all. And there you go. You have a working shortwave receiver right in your computer. So let's also demonstrate how the, um, the what the unit can do. You can change the bandwidth by pulling this. You can make it sharper to reduce interference or make it wider. And it's a wonderful thing. All right, so let's take a look at the uh, medium wave band in Ireland this evening. Medium wave. So here's a good instance. We're listening right now to um, 1000 on the dial. And if we wanted to eliminate some interference and see what the other carrier is here, let's see if we can do that. Move over to here. Should be about 1001. There we go. And we take out that signal. Let's see if we can pull it out. Maybe, maybe not. But it goes to show you just how dynamic the, the radio can be. Let's move up the dial just by pulling it with a mouse. Let's see if there's any audio here. There doesn't seem to be. Or the next carrier up.
but you can drive it just by moving your mouse around and clicking on the carriers you'd like to take a look at. Now on 1035, I think this is a BBC station. They have very, very wide bandwidth right now. Uh, it's not the BBC at all, but there you go. Give you an idea of um, how to uh, manipulate the filters. And then let's try some CW. We'll look again on 40 meters. All right. You'll see suddenly it's a very narrow signal. So by moving the uh, bandwidth around, you can make it sound much clearer. That's fun. <laughs> Somebody's calling CQ. All right. So let me show you some of the tabs here. Um, the waveform tab allows you to change how the uh, display itself looks I can show you that you can make it very dark or very bright to your liking there's audio controls there's actually a squelch control if you don't want to listen to static while you're waiting for a signal to come up there's um, audio gain control to level out low and high points in the audio the Users tab will show you who's on right now, and it's me in Somers, New York, USA. And then statistics are what's going on with the SDR itself. And then one other feature you really should know about is this little arrow here, the circular arrow that's red. That actually allows you to record what you're hearing. So if you want to make a note of something and say, oh, this is what I heard. You can record, and when you tap it again, it'll send a little file, a wave file, to your uh, computer, which you can play over and over again to analyze. And then you can bounce around this way as well by going plus or minus. You can, you can move it in increments. So that's pretty much it. We can go back down to say 198. Take a look at what the BBC is doing. And I've got to turn the audio on, don't I? Here we go. Bringing you good tidings of great joy and plenty of musical gifts. Hey, it's me, Peaches. Me, Rebecca, aka Self Esteem. So that's all about it. That's the Kiwi SDR and how to use it. And you can point anywhere in the world on those icons on the map and listen all over the world. It's really pretty amazing. All right, hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you later from N2KZ. Dit dit.